コルバット頑張れコルバットコルバットの体がディビューアディアは Wi-Fi Battle No.7 Yeah, this one was done last week versus Taco Boy off of Poke Ladder What did it on this weekend? It was last weekend though, but I was quite busy at the NASCAR race that they had here And, yeah, very tiring So this is an underused battle Versus Taco Boy, Poke Ladder, he sent out his Sneasel I sent out my Frost Sass, I'm gonna switch because I know he's gonna go for the Ice Shard Probably just to get rid of my, uh, <coughs> my, uh Focus Sash, so I switch out to my Toxic Croak, so I can vacuum wave him. And that Ice Shard does quite a bit of damage, about maybe a little bit less than a third. And I go for the vacuum wave, and that totally demolishes it, but I think it like stays on with his Focus Sash, maybe I think so. Yeah. It does, and I think this is a little bit... Oh, he tried to do counter. That, that was pretty cool. I like that. <laughs> that was a heart gold soul silver, I think, thing there. And I did that. He was asking, oh, I wasn't going to explode or anything. I'm like, I, I need to get more health. I need to get more health. So he withdraws, because he knows I'm just going to go for the vacuum wave. And I do that on his Milotic. And this is when he said, you know, this Toxic Croak is going to be a problem. So, yeah. Actually, he says that right after I poison him. So I go for the Toxic, because I know Myotics are beats in their walls and really hard to get rid of. And he goes for the Mirror Coat, thinking I'm going to attack him, so... Yeah. Haha. <laughs> so yeah, he heals up with his leftovers, and so do I, but I got the Black Sludge on. And he withdraws. And sends out his Sneasel. Thinking I'm going to, like, protect or something, but instead I go for the Dark Pulse, and that just gets rid of his Sneasel. Lucky me, it's now 2-6. Sends out his Alakazam! And I switch out to my uh, Drapion, because I know he's going to go for the Psychic, and that doesn't affect me. And he withdraws his Alakazam! Sends out his Steelix! And he's, he was talking big about this Steelix. He said this Steelix was a beast, and I'm like, if not, that, I'll build this not a lot. That actually is a lot for a Night Slash on a Steelix. If I if that was an actual real Steelix, that probably would have done nothing. That Steelix, no, a Steelix is not a good Steelix. You should see my Steelix, huh? Yeah. So he uses Earthquake. I switch it to my Altaria. It doesn't affect him. I go for the Flamethrower, and it's going to be a two-hit KO. I'm pretty sure. It goes for the Stone Edge, and this thing is not EV'd in defense, and that does not do a lot, even for a Stone Edge for it being super effective. So yeah, I did my Altarian HP and Special Defense, so it's not much of a fighter. It's just there to, like, roar, I guess. So we'll go for the Flamethrower, and that should get rid of it, I think. No, it stays. And it gets burned, luckily for me, yay! But, unlucky for me, he sends up his, sets up his Stealth Rock. Yes, that is not good. I hate Stealth Rocks. I don't use Stealth Rocks, I don't use anything like that. I don't know why. It would help a lot. Yeah. I just don't know why. I don't know. But he sends out his Milotic back again. I switch out because I know he has the Ice Beam. And I send him my Wabbity. And this is kind of like a mini Star War, I guess. Just a little mini one. And I was gonna, I'm was i going to do the Defense Curl the Rollout thing. Now, hold up. After it takes like a few turns to do it. He goes for the Ice Beam again. He's faster than me, that's pretty amazing. Goes for the Defense Curl. There you go. Blah, 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 blah. Um. He gets hurt by Poison. That's pretty good. Goes for the Ice Beam again. If I had Thick Fat, that would barely, barely do anything, though, but I'd rather have huge power. And I go for the Rollout. And that's supposed to do a lot, but it doesn't really do a lot. But then I figured out that I remember my Alethic's ability, which I forgot what it's called though, but if it has a status problem, it boosts defense, which kind of makes my Alethic even better. I don't know why it's UU. It should be overused. It's just too good to be in underused. But I keep on doing the rollout, and rollout plus poison equals you're dead. Yeah. Yeah. 
So he dies by, she dies by poison, his Malatek. I don't know if it's a guy or a girl. I think it's a guy. Taco Boy. That's, you know, probably is. And he says, I set him on top to resist the, uh, to resist the rollout, and he goes for the fake out, and this is was like, oh. Oh. And, yeah. I flinch, which is actually pretty good for me. Because I thought I would do Aqua Jet, but he's faster than me. And that just wear away his life orb. So that's pretty good. And I go for the Altaria. Because I know he has nothing against me. And he thought Steel was not very effective against Dragon. So yeah, if he would have used Bullet Punch, which I bet, bet he had, probably would have killed me. But I go for the Air Cutter. But he didn't know that. He didn't say anything at that time. I thought I just assumed that he didn't have Bullet Punch. So I go for the Air Cutter. And that actually doesn't do a lot. Because, you know, it's not really an attacking Pokemon. Mock Punch doesn't really do a lot. Life Orb wears away. Go for the Air Cutter. Gets rid of his Hitmontop. Bye bye Hitmontop. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Okay. Yeah. Heal up a little bit of leftovers. He's got two Pokemon left. Since I was Alakazam. I stay in there. Just, you know, Death Fodder. I don't know. I got nothing else. I don't want to switch. And he thought that was Hidden Power Ice. He was so mad. He was extremely mad. I'm like, I don't know. He could have, he could have like swore it was ice. I'm like, you know what? I don't really care. I'm kind of glad it wasn't ice. But yeah, it doesn't do a lot. So he's forced to switch because he's scarfed. I go for the Dragon Pulse. That does a lot on his Blaziken. Blaziken. And goes for the Flare Blitz. I'm like, you don't have anything else. I'm pretty sure any fighting move might have would have killed me. You just have to get recoil on yourself. Oh well, you're Pokemon, you're a trainer. I just saying I wouldn't do that. So I send in my Koori Sojo, which means I'm not going to tell you. I'm going to have you guys figure that out on my own. I go for the Psychic, and this is the main reason why I have Psychic fighting Pokemon who have like super effective moves like Fire This. And I'm pretty sure I'm <coughs> I made well sure that this um, this Frostlass was going to be timid, although it was the first uh, Snow Route that I caught. He goes for the trick. I go for the Shadow Ball. It doesn't really matter. And the camera's shaking for some reason. And that's game over for you. So, yeah. I won another battle. Yippee. I think I'm getting better. Yes, I am. Yes, I am.